Uh, this just in. Earlier today, a crime lord was captured after a brutal incident in the place where the brawl went down. Well, what we've done here is taken a lot of bad money off the streets. The officer was an injury and can be seen here and today taken at the place of the confrontation. Woo! That's what I call justice! Did you see that? Did you see that? Oh, it was beautiful! And that's why they call me the officer. You're going down, crime lord! I put you away for good! Get that filth out of here! Get him out of here! Y'all, you should be ashamed of yourselves! Get out of my town! Get out! Victory, baby! Victory!
Finally going perfectly this time. You didn't screw anything up for a change! At least for an hour. I can now rest knowing that nothing can go wrong. Yeah, boss. If anything was gonna happen, surely it would have happened by now. You remember that one time we got off, you dumbass! Should mother should have pushed you out her asshole and flushed for relief. Huh? Let me enlighten that 25 Walt brain of yours. An officer could break through that door any minute, take our guns, take our goods. Take our weapons, and we can end up going to jail. Or even worse, community service. Hey, do they still have those stylish orange jumpsuits? Those would be great for Team Spirit. Walking around with a stick picking up bottles. What kind of idiot thought of that? And then we can end up in the same cell together. <laughs> oh, no! Officer. Sounds like the future to me. Only I see if you can switch clean diapers. Let's do it! Enough of this heroic nonsense. Get him! One second. Ugh. Oh no, you didn't. Trying to come into my house, trying to bust me, trying to put me behind bars? I ain't going out like that. What am I paying you cops for? Metal gang, attack! <laughs> Let's get this guy. Come on, let's get him. So what did you do this weekend, Megan? I went to a pool. Really? Good afternoon, students. Today is career day, and we're going to have a visit from the town's top detective. Good afternoon, citizens. Earlier today... Justice was served. Have we all been good model citizens today? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I bet you're all wondering why I'm here. Well, I'll tell you. It's because some of you will be dealing with me in the future. Now, I'm not going to name any names, but some of you are going to cross the line at some point. Oh, it might be something simple. It might be just crossing the street the wrong way. Or better yet, one of you might just steal from a store. You! Do you like chocolate bars? Well, I'm here to tell you, don't even think about it. Yeah, sure, you might be able to ride the high wave of debauchery and madness, but sooner or later, you're going to find somebody on the end of that wave, and it's going to be a big man in the cell, and he's going to tell you what he thinks about the facts of life. Now 
You listen up, you pipsqueaks. You think you're scared now? Well, I will not rest until each and every one of you are behind bars. You hear me? Forever. Forever. I have no tolerance. No tolerance at all. Uh, detective? What's that? That's quite enough. We've run out of time. Oh, well, you know, I'm just happy to do my duty. After all, I love visiting these up new rising bright shining stars. But remember, I'll be seeing you all very soon. Ah! Good afternoon, ma'am. How are you this afternoon? I'm fine. Great. Listen, I'm just in the uh, area here. I wanted to show you the back you suck 3,000. Ma'am, this machine sucks. I gotta tell you, I bet you could pick up a car with this machine right here. In fact, I bet you could take a small family hostage just by using this machine. <laughs> oh my. I mean, this thing is for real. Oh, I never... Oh. <laughs> Who's this? He's, he's just... I'm having an off day. He looks like he's in a bit of a fuss. Uh, do you think you could come back later, please? Not a problem, ma'am. We'll be back a little later on then. Okay, oh, fine. Okay, oh. thanks. <laughs> Doctor says I should probably get someone to drive for me because I can't be driving like, like this. I knew someday you were gonna get hurt at work. How did you say you hurt your eye again? Oh, I told you a piece of shrapnel hit me in the eye when I was defending justice. Look, I don't want to talk about it. I just want to talk to my sweetheart because we're still getting married. The wedding's still on. I'm not letting this little eye problem get in the way of that. Well, let's have a look. Oh, by the way, your cousin phoned. He's in town. He's on vacation or something. What? I don't talk to him! Ah! I'm going to my room, huh? me, the Vagina Survivor Man. Hey, I seen you on TV. Don't call me little man, Bambino. Don't worry, buddy. You got a little tiger inside. And don't call me Bambino. I could snap your sternum, one blow, my forehead, to your chest, killing you gradually. Hmm, that's true, but I bet you didn't know that you'd be killing one of your own. Come on, the day you become a cop is a day I say, oh my god. It's real. Hello? <laughs> oh, hey, baby, what's going on? Right, right. Oh, I'll uh, have to make that up to you. No, I'm at the super officer's house right now. <laughs> right, that's naughty. That's naughty, right? And that's disgusting. Okay, gotta go by. Guess what? I love that girl. And I'm driving. It's gonna be just like that time. not like that, and I don't need your help. Sure you do. You got one day left at work, you got wedding errands to run, who's gonna help your moms around the house? That you can do. Go help her do something. Forget that. I'm driving. Lieutenant, what's with the color of these walls in here? 
kind of matches your tie. Orange. Orange. I said gray. What drunk did you let out of the tank to paint this place? I like it. You get that. Paint her back in here next week and get it redone. Gray. Now get out of here. Yes, Commissioner. Come on in. That's good work. I'm going to go take a seat. So, you're on traffic detail. What? I worked my ass off to get to this position, sir. Yes, you did. Well, this ain't fair. Listen, I'm not wasting my best detective on some freak. What did you say happened? Practice training session, sir. Paintball gun. Paintball hit me right in the eye. Bust my cornea, but I talked it out at first and it got infected, sir. Are you sure you need it? No, you know what? I don't. No, 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 no. Put it back on. Put it back on. You want to be able to work here next week. Hey, is that your cousin out there? Oh, come on. You tell him I said hi. So, traffic detail. And take that canine with you. This is injustice. What? What do you mean, what? I'm on traffic detail with this dog and you driving me. <laughs> What's the dog's name anyway? Dr. Bell Colossus, but I call it a bike for short. Well, that doesn't even make any sense. I know. It's amazing. Yeah, that is amazing. Alright, next mission. We go to the balloon shop to get some balloons for the wedding supplies, and there should be a shop right up here. Hey babe, I said I was gonna make that up to you. So what are you doing anyway? Shane, wait, who's Shane? Who's Shane? Right, uh, hold on babe, I'm gonna have to call you back. This just in, earlier today a crime lord was captured after a brutal incident in the place where the brawl went down. Well, what we've done here is taken a lot of bad money off the streets. The officer was an injury and can be seen here and today taken at the place of the confrontation. Woo! That's what I call justice! Did you see that? Did you see that? Oh, it was beautiful! And that's why they call me the officer. You're going down, crime lord! I put you away for good! Get that filth out of here! Get him out of here! Y'all, you should be ashamed of yourselves. Get out of my town. Get out. Victory, baby. Victory. Oh, man. What is this? Where's my car? Where's my car? Baby, baby, we're getting married. Can't wait. Oh, God, it's going to be such a beautiful wedding. Hi, Mom. Hi. <laughs> Some people are saying that the actions of the officer were over the top and should be frowned upon. Others are asking for his badge. The victim's families are no doubt glad to see this notorious mobster off the streets. After a major tussle this morning, it was looking like the longtime madman and crime lord was going to be behind bars for a very long time. In a last minute test, it was found that all the evidence has been contaminated. Crime Lord is said to be set free. This anchorman just hopes lessons are learned and the streets remain calm. After the commercial break, a frumper at the skate park. And how the city plans on eliminating bicycle seat sniffing perverts. Okay. Hmm. Nice. 
puppy. Water? Oh. Can I? Oh. Give me those uh, streamers and balloons over there. Yeah, uh, 375. Lobby your eye. The costume part. Keep change. Oh man, I got some bad news. Oh wait, here it is right here. It's just in. Notorious mobster, ex-professional hitman, crime lord, has been let out of jail on account of contaminated samples taken from the scene of the crime. Although it's not clear what happened yet, the police say they will not rest until they find out who did this. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Oh man, no respect. No respect for solid police work. First I tracked them down, then I beat up their goons. Remember that fan that I told you about? I mean, that's such a great idea. And now I had my two by four and I smashed the one on the head. And, oh. Yeah, man, that's bullshit. Two years, man, two years. I've been trying to get this guy behind bars and this is what happens? Yeah, you think he's gonna take it personal? Who, crime lord? Nah, he's probably just happy to be out. I don't know, he might be thinking about how to make this never happen again. Yeah, at least the dog liked you. Come on, let's go get a drink. Do I have to remind you we're on duty? Our shirts? It's lunchtime. Just throw on that old dirty shirt back there. Oh man, drinks, burgers, I've got a great spot. Yeah, I've complained about the vacuum suck. It sucks way too hard. Oh. Oh. Pizza Palace, can I take your order? <laughs> no, it's just me. Who is it? Yeah, it's me. It's me! You twerp, you ask for breath, you half dumb wit tart, me! No, seriously, who is it? It's me, you ridiculous example for a human being. Oh, boss, is that you? I need a pickup, you redneck. Yeah, you, you want a pickup? Yes, I need a okay. pickup. Alright, I'll see you there. Hey guys, come on in. Hey man.
It's dry as a desert in here. I need something to wet my whistle. Whoop, whoop. What is that? Ah. Steam whistle. The good beer, folks. What are we in a beer commercial? Shot over there. Oh yeah? Yeah. People say he's the best card player around. He gets real nervous when you look at him. He always carries. He never misses. My lunch break. I don't want no trouble. Ah, nothing, Bambino. Let's have a drink. Ah, don't call me Bambino. Only Ma called me that. Honestly, Bambino, this could end up like that time. You two boys, sit down!
iCard deals, doesn't it? I'm out. Join me at the bar for a drink. Drink, you say? They say a shot helps, man, with the pain. When a bullet hits you. A bullet, you say? Let me pour you a dog. Westerns? As a matter of fact, I do. Hey! Do you want to have an old-fashioned shootout? Let's do this. With that backwards pistol, I might be done for. But I accept. You dirty asshole. Now we can't miss. Like 
you don't seem to catch on. Pay attention. Bring so much attention to yourself? Ah, come on, Bambino. Mm. You were right there. Besides, it's not like I need help with his fancy pants. One of these days. I'm not gonna be around forever, you know. There's far more dangerous people out there. Quick shot. Guys! Anyway, it's like that time. Because there's nothing dangerous out here. Yeah, right. Watch for sharks and krakens, man. Sharks and kra kra ah, 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 get it off! Get it off! It's nothing like that. Besides, when this eye patch is gone, you're out of here. Enough of this jibber jabber. This crap out there. Well, 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 what have we here? Grandma's house. <laughs> Shut it. Just thinking of our crime lord problem here. He's been out for a little while. Where do you think he went? Might want to call your mom, uh, see if she's okay. Call home? That I can do. If it'll shut you up, I will do it. Good man, good. Why don't you ask her if she's making bread? I'm not asking her if she's making bread. Come on man, just ask her if she's making bread. Like, it's not that big a deal. Are you making bread? Are you making bread? It's like four words. Are you making bread? I'm not asking her if she's making bread, man. I'm just gonna call her and ask her if she's doing okay. And then we gotta get the rest of the wedding supplies. And hopefully I'm gonna get this damn eye patch off. Ah! God! Ugh. I hate you! Man, how can you say that? I'm your cuz! Oh, Besides, there's something on the road. Would you please, please just shut the hell up and let me talk to my mom? Please, just for a minute. Just for a minute. And don't forget to ask about the bread. Hello, Ma? Yes, dear. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm, I'm fine. Could you come home right away? She says she's fine. Happy? Better safe than sorry, man. Yeah, Ma, I'm on my way. We're just finishing up the, uh, yeah, the rest of the wedding supplies. That's right. And then we're coming right up. Oh, and Ma? Are you making bread? You, uh, expecting someone? Answer it. I don't want anything to seem strange. Hello there again, ma'am. How are you doing today? <laughs> now listen, old man. Now you do exactly as I say! Or the old lady gets it. Oh my goodness! I'll do whatever you say. I got an ex-wife, and she's got kids. 
get in the bag. You can do good bread, Mr. Duncan, huh? So the bread should be like perfect. It's gonna be ready like. Ma never vacuums at the front door. What the heck? It's a trap! Who's that guy? He looks really familiar. It's a trap! Maybe your arch nemesis or shining beacon of example. Oh, please, shining beacon of example. So you did it, man. Sure did, Bambino. Uh, just this one time, cuz. 
Aww. Hey, watch out for cops out there. No speeding. Yeah, right. Come on, let's go back inside. Thank you for taking a short break. So you don't think I could be romantic? Watch this.
Crime Lord, how are you feeling these days? How do I feel? I'm... This stupid mic, you're making me sick. Well, for all you stupid little people out there in TV land, I don't feel too good. I mean, sure, I might feel rehabilitated right now. And yeah, I'm looking to become a decent member of society by cleaning up the trash. And this is what they call trash? This ain't trash. That's trash. Everything out there, these buildings, these people, it makes me violently ill to my stomach. The court ordered has me out here picking up all this garbage. I ain't too happy about that. That don't sit well with Crime Lord. But I tell you something, while well, they got that buffoon selling vacuum cleaners in a nice air conditioned room, I'm out here getting soaked by the stupid rains from the heavens on my head. I don't know much I could take of it anymore. However, I said I'd do my part. I committed the crime, I am doing the time. Right now, I just want to become a decent member of society, do my part, and uh, maybe join Officer and his little fight against crime. Because being out here ain't doing me no good. So yeah, the court has me out here. I'm just sick of being out here. I want to get out there and show everyone the new me. Yeah, that's good.